RSR family, it is always a great day whenever we can get some Beatles here on the channel. Honestly, this is probably one of our favorite groups yes. since we've started the channel. We've learned so much about them as a group and individually. Oh my gosh, discovering them individually and as a band and all the different points in their career and all the different sounds. They're so intriguing and fascinating. Makes sense why they are the greatest band of all time. The absolute greatest. But if you guys are new here to the channel, welcome to Rob Squad Reactions. You are here every single day with your boy Jay. And your girl Amber. And today we have the Beatles and the song is Ticket to Rap. Y'all said we would really enjoy this one. Y'all said it has some really cool aspects in it. So we yeah. are ready to get to it. But before we get started, make sure you guys like this video. Hit that subscribe button. Come join the RSR family. And turn on that post notification bell so you never miss a video. But y'all some of the suggestions. We got to give the people what they want. We wanted some Beatles as well. It's hard to say. <laughs> yeah, everybody wants the Beatles. Let's some Beatles. go check it out. Beatles. The Beatles. Ticket to Ride. If I can get my headphones unstuck, we'll start it. Let's check it out. Their voices, when they're overlapped and That's singing cool. together like that, is yeah. absolutely amazing. And as always, Ringo just looks so unfazed. <laughs> Every I, but, video, he just he just looks so unfazed. But what's cool about this one, this song to me, is Ringo. I, uh, to me, that's what's standing out. Like, it's kind of a sad song. He's talking about the girl is leaving. She's got a ticket to ride. She's got a ticket right. to go. And she doesn't even care. And so it is a sad song, but... What gives it the sad undertone, I feel like, is the pace of the, of drums. the drums. And and that's really, really cool. I I love how much they stand out in this one. Ringo is kind of still on the show a little <laughs> bit, besides the fact that these vocals are saying in a really groovy way. I dig it. Like I said, it is their voices overlap together. Yeah. Literally sounding like one is awesome. And uh, Paul McCartney always gets to meet with, he has the most baby face. Like from like, baby yeah, face. from like not really seeing him in his younger career. We've, we've discovered him more lately, but his face was so, I mean, he looks so, so young. Let's get back. Well, that's driving me mad.
George Harrison's part was fun. Too. Like just the absolute goats, the greatest of all time. Like who else can just sit there, sit around like them, and just make that sound? I I I I, I, I can't even think of anybody to compare to the Beatles. And it's funny because like I feel like we talk about stage presence a lot. And with they don't me, need it. I feel like I'm just so fascinated by just even seeing them, right? I'm just so fascinated by just getting to know that I'm witnessing the Beatles and getting to just like really enjoy their music. I'm just fascinated and by that alone. Like Ringo just standing there, it does something for you. Like in, in my terms, the Beatles are the Michael Jordan of uh, of bands. Oh, don't get started. They, they are the greatest <laughs> of all time for bands. Yeah. Like, there's, there's, like I said, there's just no comparing anything to them and the songs that they've done and the different, you know, the different experiments they've done with their songs, like yeah, a strawberry yeah. fits forever to a hell, you know, to this right here, there is, it, 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 it blows my mind every time we listen to a, yeah. to a new Beatles song. Yeah. It, it really well, does. For sure. And you know, a lot of people would argue though that Michael Jordan isn't the goat. <laughs> a lot of people Not would argue. Now you Not can't really argue that, that about the Beatles. You can't really argue it. They're just... They're so their music is so diverse. Like you feel like you really got to see them grow from of course, yes, they're young here, and then all the other blends of of sounds that we've heard from them throughout the years. It's just like really, really cool to see. It feels like you saw them evolve and grow. You got to see them dig different things, get into different things, and then just kind of see what they like and be really creative. And so it's cool. They didn't stick to the same no. thing. See, and one of the things that I absolutely love, you know, learning so much about them that we have, like, they're, they're all just cool, down-to-earth, like, genuine guys. Like, yes. like, like, like there's not, like, a jerk in the group. Like, like there's, there's not a butthead in the group. Like, they're all just really cool, down-to-earth, genuine people. So that makes me like them even more. Yeah, yeah. This was fast, fantastic, guys. I'm glad that we got to listen to some more. And, of course, we will continue to listen to some more Beatles, no but doubt. what should be the next one? Drop it down in the comments. We love you guys as we always send you out of here every single day. We love you. We thank you. We appreciate you. And remember every day that you wake up, it is a blessing and that you are blessed. And for your new family members that hit that subscribe button down below, we welcome you guys to the RSR family. But y'all will go every day just like we do. And the rest of the family, let them know. Mom. All right, guys. All you got to do is make somebody smile. We love you guys. Until next time, we'll see y'all later.